Xavier? Yeah. You're gonna need to get over here quick. Alright, bye. I made a time machine. Okay. That's not good. What'd you really call me for? Alright, no, I'm serious. I actually made a time machine. It's right there. This is my car. The one you took two weeks ago. Okay. I took it for a good reason. Because, you know, obviously, I built a time machine. So, you built a time machine. With my car. Why don't you tell me after you time traveled? I don't know how to drive. And you're sure it works? Dude, I worked on this for two weeks. I'm positive. Come on. Wait. What now? I gotta get dressed. Hold on, stay there. Ah! All right, I'm ready. Four. All right, here we are. I have one issue with this. Why is it not a DeLorean? Dude, I'm not freaking rich, okay? I can tell, because you borrowed my car! All right, you don't have to rub it in. Jeez. All right, let's, let me show you how it works, okay? That is the flux capacitor. Our flux capacitor. Just looks like you duct taped the bottom of the Sprite bottle to a camp light. Well, it's not, okay? This is like high grade technical stuff. And this is our power source. But no touchy, okay? It's in, my, it's a part of my car. It's in my car. Okay, I paid $500 dollars. <laughs> you it. paid $500 dollars. You said you were broke. I'm broke now because of it. Okay? Oh my. Okay, this is gonna power our time traveling adventures. All right? And this is the key to everything. What is that? This is our time gauge. This is where we put in the years that we want to travel to. Let's do this. All right. Power it up. Wait! You're right. Safety first. And now, I shall set the time gauge. 2020. What do we gotta do to time travel? Well, we gotta get to 88, baby. I think it worked. What do we do now? Well, I haven't told you why we came. Why we come? Well, in the future, it turns out that we get into a fight and I kill you. So, 
we came here to kill the future me so that I can't kill you. Wait. Why don't you just kill yourself? If you knew you were gonna kill me, then why don't you just kill yourself then rather than building a whole ass time machine out of my car to, so we can team up to kill you? Well, because reasons, okay? But we're already here in the future, so we gotta do this. It's so important to save me then. Because <sighs> in the future, aliens come to Earth and you sacrifice yourself for anal probing. Yeah, so that's the only way aliens don't blow up the earth. Okay, what's the plan? Alright, so, the future me is just sitting inside that house on the couch. Mm -hmm. So the plan is, we're gonna get this gun and shoot him in the brains. Mm -hmm. But there's a catch. What's the catch? Right here. The power source. Now, this not only powers this car for time travel, but it also... This is the amount of time we have to complete the mission. How long is that? 15 minutes. What happens if we don't come back in 15 minutes? <sighs> then your car's not gonna have enough juice to get back to the past. Okay, let's do it quick then. Let's do this. Hold this. It's locked. I got this. Alright, this way. Sarah Connor. What the hell? I don't know, I just thought it'd be funny, you know, like a Terminator reference. Alright, alright. Alright, let's blast. We still got time, let's go. Okay. Alright, hey. Woo! Alright, 2020, here we come. Alright, let's go. Oh shit, the fuck's the capacitor? Mm, shit! Right there. You're alive in the future! Yes! Get the fuck out of my car. I'm taking all my shit with me though.
time. I'm not gonna die yet. Shit, come on. You gotta go after him, let's go.